There are a lot of zone control valves to choose from here at Sprinkler Warehouse. This video will help you understand the things you need to consider when selecting a valve. What's the difference between inline valves and anti-siphon valves? And how do you know which ones to use? Anti-siphon valves are so named because each valve has an anti-siphon device built into it to prevent the backflow siphonage of possibly contaminated sprinkler water from getting into your drinking water. They must be installed above ground to work correctly, and they need to be protected from freezing weather. They are typically installed as part of a front yard and backyard manifold. This makes the valves very easy to find and service when needed, but does require using more pipe in your overall sprinkler system design. Inline control valves get their name because the valves are buried underground, in line with your system's pipe, usually in the middle of a sprinkler zone, and are protected by a valve box. Because the valve is located below ground and the top of the valve box is at ground level, they are less susceptible to freezing temperatures. Typically, using inline control valves require less pipe because the valves are located closer to the sprinkler heads and not in a manifold group like anti-siphon valves and provides more equalized water pressure within your zones. And when buried underground in a valve box, the landscaping looks more natural. Many customers ask, since inline control valves don't have an anti-siphon protection component in their design, why would you ever want to install them in your system? With inline valves, you are able to protect your entire system by installing a single backflow protection valve between the water supply and your sprinkler system. This higher quality backflow prevention device is testable and can be certified as working properly, which means you always know that your drinking water is safe and protected. Although you don't need to purchase a separate mainline backflow device like you would when using inline valves, there is a drawback associated with using anti-siphon valves. The built-in backflow prevention mechanism is not testable and cannot be certified that it is working properly. For more information about the advantages and disadvantages of using inline or anti-siphon valves in your sprinkler system, watch the Sprinkler System Design Basics video located on the video page of our website. Also, not all municipalities or water districts allow the installation of anti-siphon control valves because they are untestable. Make sure you check with your local regulations before purchasing one. From azaleas to rose bushes, from sago palms to carrots, Sprinkler Warehouse has everything for your irrigation needs. And if you have any questions about our products, give us a call or chat with one of our customer service agents on sprinklerwarehouse.com. They really know their stuff and they'll get you squared away. Remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel for more how-to videos and irrigation tips. For Sprinkler Warehouse, I'm Alfred Castillo, your Sprinkler Warehouse Pro.